Now we're going to demonstrate the applicator placements on a, a live person. And we thank this young man for being willing to, uh, to do that. So again, here's the loop applicator and here's the pad applicator. Both of them running now at the same time. Mason, can you hold them? All right. You're feeling something strong, right? Yep. Okay. Where would you like to place this applicator? Can we place it on your shoulder? Now this applicator has a Velcro strap, so you can actually place it on the chest or around the belly uh, or around the lower back to hold it in place. You don't have to do that, but it's available if you need to or want to. So we'll put this on Mason's shoulder. And then what we'll do is we'll place this on Mason, Mason's knee and Again, Mason, if you could use your other hand to kind of hold that together. So that's one way to treat the knee. You could take that applicator and you could wrap it around the knee with, a, again, the compressed, compressing the sides together. Are you feeling any contractions? Yes. Where? Knee. In your knee? Yeah. Okay. You don't feel anything with that there? Yeah, I do. You feel a contraction there as well? Yes. Okay. Now let's let's really let's really demonstrate a contraction. Leave, leave it there. It's okay. And you put this on your stomach. Feel my knee more. You feel you need more. Yes. Okay. Um, in fact, they're bo both basically about the same intensity, especially when you bring the sides closer together. Now let's put this on your back. Tell us what you feel over your back. Can you hold that there, please? Yes, I feel that now. Do you feel it in your stomach? A little bit. Yeah. I'll feel off and we'll do that. We'll feel it in the stomach. So this allows you then to treat two body parts at the same time. You could actually treat you know, both knees at the same time. You can put it behind the knees as well. And then, as I demonstrated earlier, you can bring it up, up the uh, up the leg. Um, now, let's let's do something that we might be able to see more contractions. Let's put that down for a second, and let's put it around your your head, on your neck, on your neck. Now you can really see. Yes. Is that uncomfortable? <laughs> Not really. It feels good. It's all right. Yeah. Um, now, there is something I should probably alert you to. Mason has a hard jewelry. That's probably not a good thing to be putting a strong magnetic field over jewelry because you might sometimes, in some cases, you might get a little bit of a, a, a jolt. So that's significantly stronger, right? Yes. You can feel that stronger than you felt yes. this. Yes. You're okay? Yes. That's how strong the, the smaller applicators get. Let's do, let's do um, over your thighs. So you can see the foot bobbing a little bit. Now let's take that and wrap it around the thigh. Squeeze it together, break, lift your leg up. All right, and wrap it like that. Is that more noticeable? Yes, it all around. Yeah. All right, now, the good thing about magnetic field therapy, too, is because it goes through clothing. You don't have to prepare for it. You don't have to undress. Uh, you don't have to take off bandages or wraps or uh, belts or anything like that. And you can also put it, that it goes through shoes. So you can actually, you know, bring it together. And if you're treating, um, Plantar fasciitis, you can just put your feet right over top of it. And I can feel it going up through my shoes. All right, if you want to hold it in place on your body, um, you can slip it under a shirt or under a jacket just to keep it in place. Very simple, very easy to use. Again, these are two, these are applied together, allow you to treat two areas of the body at the same time. Now what we can do is we can actually put this applicator in the back 
And then we put this applicator in the front. You have to find a way to keep it together. And what are you feeling now? Stomach. A lot more stomach contractions? Yes. So this is a magnetic sandwich. by treating the stomach and the back at the same time. So you can actually treat the back and the belly at the same time. And when you have a lot of pelvic issues going on, like women with endometriosis or somebody who, after surgery, that this decreases the total treatment time just by being able to treat from both areas at the same time, using the magnetic sandwich approach again, but using the smaller applicators. All right. Any, any questions? Anything else you'd like to treat? No, I'm good. Okay. So again, with the loop coil, you can do this around the head. I'm not going to demonstrate that because we're at the highest intensity. But you can use this to treat the brain. Um, for depression, Parkinson's, any significant neurological conditions. But you're always going to start off low and gradually increase the intensity. Um, now, I have, myself, I have some fillings and, uh, I'm sorry, implants. And when you put a very high intensity magnetic field around the mouth, Depending on the hardware you might have in your jaw and your mouth, this could actually cause a jolt for you. It might be uncomfortable. So again, you have to go low and slow when you're treating around the head, uh, around the head in particular, and certainly around the jaw. That's it.